Welcome to this new edition of the Buena Vista Rural Club. Well, to be honest, activity is getting frantic here at the Buena Vista Rural Club. We're trying to finish waterproofing the roof. We've installed the solar panels and finishing off the distribution and getting all the lighting wired in. We're digging out the floor of the workshop and getting ready to lay a concrete floor. We're going to be putting in new rafters into the barn and then retiling with the old tiles. We're installing a water tank with all the plumbing. We've installed security cameras on the roof so that we can see 360 around the buildings. And we're getting ready to landscape the area immediately around the farmhouse. We are mixing up cement. We're going to be putting in a drop in the roof so that the water doesn't get stuck and goes down the gutter. So hopefully this is going to be the last step that we need to do before we actually put the waterproof membrane on the concrete roof. As you can see, it's a fine day today. We've got the solar panel in place. We've now got solar running. The batteries are fully charged and that's giving us all of the power that we need. So today, the fruits of the last few weeks labor are all coming together. And a bit later, I'll be introducing you to a new person, Angel, who is a chap who's come to help to dig out the workshop floor so that we can start to concrete that and get the workshop up and running. Remember that what we need is a workshop that's working, that's, uh, that's functioning, it must not leak, and it must have a good floor, and then we can put the benches in, and we can really start in earnest, working with the roof for the barn over there, and starting to really get to grips with what needs to be done here on the farm. This is Angel. Angel. Hola. Ah. He's a friend of Roberto's. I'm from the same part of the world, Cuba. Hello. Well, this week I'd really like to thank all of the new subscribers that have come on board in the last few weeks. The channel is really gaining traction and it gives me a lot of pleasure to see people subscribing. Thank you for liking, thank you for sharing, and thank you for subscribing to the channel. We're getting close to our goal. Please spread the word. I'd like to be able to open up at the Buena Vista Rural Club soon to have people coming uh, and spending the day here and being able to walk up there in the mountains. There are some fantastic trails and the, our farm extends right up there. You can see beyond that ridge and way up. It goes thousands of meters that way. And of course it starts, all starts way down there. This is the agricultural side of the farm, would you believe? We used to farm blackberries here. Can you, you can see the blackberries that have taken over completely here. All of this land is going to have to be cleared. When you, when you look at this, you can see that the blackberries are, what, three, three and a half, four meters high? That's all going to have to be cut out. And one of the things we've got planned is to buy a tractor or a bobcat with a big pincer hand on the front of it to start ripping out these blackberry bushes as quickly as possible. If anybody knows of a uh, a uh, bobcat, skid, uh, skid steer that's being sold in the Canary Islands at a reasonable price, second hand, let me know because uh, we're very much interested in buying that. And at the moment I'm trying to get together the money that we need to buy that. And um, it's the next stage after the workshop's complete is starting to work a little bit on the farm and also to get the barn roof on. So we've got a series of projects coming up on the Buena Vista Rural Club. So we don't want you to miss out on any of that. So please subscribe so that you can follow our videos on a weekly basis. The videos at the moment are released on a Sunday just after midday. 
So have a look uh, at your uh, YouTube on a, on a Sunday and you'll catch the latest episode. And we put out a, at the moment, one a week. That frequency may very well increase as we get closer and closer to being complete. And of course, the ultimate idea is for you to come here to the farm and participate in our YouTube film, in our YouTube um, weekly episodes. So that you come here, you do your outside sports, mountain climbing, uh, walking in the, in the, up, the, uh, up in the mountain, um, what's it called, hiking, um, but also coming and seeing how the farm is coming along and getting put together. And we're going to be here, this big, this big building here is where the meeting room is going to be. At the moment the generator is in there, so you're going to see quite a lot of noise now. I'll probably go to a bit of music for this. Well, the barn is going to have to be re-roofed. Re we can use the existing tiles that we've got there, but we're going to have to put new beams and joists in in order to support it. And that's another one of the very many jobs that we're going to have to do here at the Buena Vista Rural Club. So, hang in there and keep watching. We look forward to every single episode. This is a two-way water level. It's taken, taken a level from zero to a water flow down that way. Today we've got the ladder in the right place, in the gap in the wall. That is made for the stairs to come up and down. So today we're going to be doing that because Angel is going to be taking wheelbarrows of earth out of the warehouse, of the, out of the uh, workshop and putting it down there to start filling in this area in front with dirt and making it level. This is the solar room. Excuse the uh, cement mixer, which is just outside the door, mixing the cement. But here you can see the control panel and the battery. And the fact that we're up to 14 volts, 14.1 volts, because we've got electricity coming in from the solar panel to the battery. We can see it there. And we've got a modem. The battery indication is high. Lights are on. The generator is running the cement mixer, not the solar power, because we've actually only got the one battery and it's a fairly small inverter that we've got, just 300 watts. But that will be changing and we'll have a higher um, rating on the inverter very soon when we buy a new one. This is Pedro. Pedro comes from La Guancha. Pedro vivo en La Guancha. In La Guancha. And he's the laborer. By the way, they said four more bags of cement last week, four more bags of sand. And this morning we picked up eight bags of sand, and now we've got 20 more and four more bags of cement. So the quantity surveyor around here is a bit off, I've got to say. And who is the quantity surveyor? The man up there. Jose! There he is, the quality surveyor.
flowers are uh, a protected species around here. They're not uh, wild fuchsias at all. Well, I don't know if they're part of the fuchsia family or not, but I do know that they're highly protected because they only grow in this part of the world, in the Teno National Park, and they need water. So you can imagine there aren't that many places around here that have got the kind of water that we've got on this farm. Well, this is a very important plant, very important indeed, and completely forbidden to cut it down. So there we are, we're going to cherish it. So slowly we're filling in this uh, this part of the ground here to bring it up to level with the dirt that we're getting out of the workshop. But here in the workshop we've come across something strange, or not strange, something we didn't expect, and that is rock. The, uh, the ground here is actually just one complete big volcanic rock <coughs> just just here comes all the way from over here and it comes all the way over to the door And it's all solid. We weren't expecting that. Jesus is back. Say hello, Jesus. Hello, big boy. <laughs> back from Venezuela. And uh, he spent uh, a few months over there with his family. And now he's back to help, which is great because we need him. A la vez, ya que nadie haga nada. Que picó la pared.
I hope with all the things that we've shown you on this episode that we've, we've earned a like from you at least. A comment down below, we'd love to read your comments. I try and respond to every single one of them personally. Thanks very much indeed for watching and don't miss out on the next few episodes of the Buena Vista Rural Club because we're going to be doing some really exciting things, getting the roof back on this room, finishing off the workshop, getting the water up on the roof, finishing the waterproofing, the whole bunch of stuff. And of course, spreading the solar energy so that we have at least light in every room. So don't miss out, subscribe, share, like, and comment. Thanks very much and take care. Thank you.